As you can hear, there's a the garbage truck picking up our garbage because, well, I work in my garage. But anyways, I'm about to burn some screens, introduce myself for the first time since I hate putting my ugly mug on the camera. I usually avoid it because, well, that's not fun to look at. But hey, now you guys gotta deal with the agony along with me. Enjoy the ride. <laughs> so we're gonna burn some screens. Let's do it. how this job was even going to turn out because this emulsion has been pretty much been sensitized for well past when I should use it but I really didn't want to have to crack open my new one yet and uh, thought I'd give it a shot so according to my exposure calculator I'm actually one step below I'm underexposed where I should be um, so my guess is uh, even though my magic number usually works this stuff started to kind of not be um, as reliable because it was basically about to expire. I also tried it a technique I usually don't do. I probably just need to perfect it, but uh, I tried carting off my edges this time, which actually created like, wouldn't call it a dam, but like a bead, that an unnecessary bead, was, which is ironically what you're trying to avoid when you cart off, when you're trying to remove shit like that. So ironically, I either did it wrong or, um, I don't know, maybe my, uh, my coating was too thick. I also gave a, a two to two coat, uh, try for the first time. I've only done uh, one to one or, uh, one to two or whatever. I've never done two to two. I just thought I'd give it a shot since I'm also doing half tones for the very first time. I wanted to test out half tones on my 500 watt light because even though that thing is very capable of exposing everything I've done so far. I've read and heard that uh, half tones are a pain in the ass and you won't get the dot that you're you're after. But man, I'm actually quite impressed both with my uh, half-ass Photoshop job and uh, the results are, I mean, they look literally like my artwork. So I'm happy with it. I'm not even tripping about it. I think it turned out great. I also had to go get my kid from school the other day as I was degreasing these and getting them ready for prep. And um, I think I hustled it a little too fast because I did get some fish eye um, in a couple spots. So I must have definitely left. Oh, where is it? There's one. Where the fuck did it go? Oh, this is probably too hard to even show you on the video. Anyways, um, there is clearly some contaminant in the emulsion still. And it didn't ruin it, but I don't know if that's gonna cause issues on press. I don't think so. We'll see. But anyways, uh, long story long, it turned out pretty dope. Uh, I can't wait to print it because um, I've never actually pushed ink through a half tone before. So it should be fun. It's kind of just a test. Anyways, thanks for tuning in, guys.